Hello, I'm Mr. Lopez and today we're going to do some drawing experiments working with a pipette. Before you start your work you need four things. You need to uh, prepare your space, get your materials, make a playlist if you want to listen to music and set up some time. For today's task you're going to need some uh, newspaper to put under your work, some paper, can be plain or a striped paper, a brush, a pipette, a straw, uh, some water, some paint which should be 50% paint, 50% water uh, and some uh, paper towels. Uh, the first thing that we're going to do is uh, just experiment with our materials, our experiment with our pipette and paint. Uh, you can just drop some uh, paint into your paper, you can use the pipette to uh, create like a line drawing. Uh, remember that if you use too much paint you can always uh, take some paint back with the empty pipette and drawing the paint back into it. Uh, the water, we use the water to uh, have more control over the surfaces. So wherever you put water, uh, once you put paint on it, the the paint will stay into that section with water. So this is uh, really good if you want to have a more organized uh, section in your work. With the straws, we can uh, create like a splash. You first you draw with your pipette, and then you use. Uh, the straw to blow through it and then uh, the lines will start going in different directions. Uh, and lastly you can use the paper towel to uh, remove some paint from the paper and create like a, a worn uh, kind of looking section uh, and that's it. The first thing that you should try is making a continuous line drawing using the pipette. Uh, for my example I used uh, a poppy flower and it's just trying to follow the uh, main shapes with uh, a continuous line like without removing the uh, pipette from the paper as much as possible. Uh, once you're confident with your uh, control over the pipette, uh, try to experiment with different techniques. I would suggest try to use at least two or three of the techniques that we've seen in this video together in uh, a new drawing. Uh, try experimenting with the straw, try experimenting with the uh, paper towel, try experimenting with water to gain some control over the, your surface. Uh, see the different things that you can uh, do, you will create a very uh, experimental, very uh, organic drawing. And that's it. I hope this video was useful to you. Uh, uh, see you next time.